Well, the town of Jean Lafitte is bringing back part of its history tomorrow when racers hop into their P-Rogues and take to the water. We do want to see if uh, Duke Carter will get in one of those boats. He's uh, live down in Jean Lafitte this morning yeah. with uh, Mayor Tim Kerner taking a look back at history, the history of the races, and what we can expect. At least we know one thing, if you're on the water, at least it'll be cooler than just being out. Yeah, Dad, that'll be good to be on the water, but I'm going to take a break and actually let the pros do it here in Jean Lafitte. As you can see, a lot of folks, about four men on the water in their pirogues. But as you mentioned, Eric, I am here with Mayor Tim Kerner, who actually has a beautiful display of seafood, really good. Um, but talk to us about what's happening this weekend, sir. Well, we we, we bring him back the... Uh the world famous Piro races, uh, you know, it, it used to be a big thing all the way back to 1934. And, uh, you know, over the years, it, it, it was very huge in, in the Lafitte Baritaire and Crown Point area. Mm -hmm. And then for whatever reason, it it, 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 um, it stopped about 13 years ago. And, and uh, now we're bringing it back and we're very excited. I can tell that you got a lot of energy. How many people are we expecting to, to come out for, for, the, for the races tomorrow? I'm thinking we'll have a couple thousand people out here watching these races. And, and, and look, it's, it's not a pirogue race. It's, it, it's going to be a pirogue race in a mini little seafood festival with, and with, a, with a, uh, good entertainment, mm -hmm. a lot of crafts and, and um, local artists painting. So it, it's going to be nice. Talk to us about some of the races that we can expect. I was, I was hearing that you can go a mile down, then a mile back, and, and we got different type of categories. Talk about that. Well, you're going to... I'm going to have to get my son on, on that Mr. one right Kerner. here because he's actually put it together for me, the uh -huh. races. Yeah, well, we have uh, 11 races. We have a two-mile race men's championship. We're calling it the world's championship. Uh -huh. We have uh, dug decoy races where people go across the bayou, pick up decoys. We yes, have uh, canoe races for two-person canoes, kayaks. So we have a race for everybody, every age, 13 mm -hmm. to 16 year olds, over 50. So we have a little something for everybody. So. How does it feel? Because I think your dad told us that you're, you and, and, and the other were, were responsible for pushing having the P-Rogue races back. Right, right. You know, I think we all were a part of it. I think the entire community wanted it back, and we all kind of felt it. Mm -hmm. So uh, this was a, it wasn't a matter if we were going to bring it back. It was a matter of when. And uh, with this building, you know, this was the time to do it. So. And it's this would be one. your first? My first one, yeah. <laughs> I'm 27 years old. The last, you know, real big one that brought huge crowds. It, it was 20 years ago, two decades ago. So, yeah, I'm excited. Gotcha. Last question for you, sir. You're also part of bringing the p Rock races back. How does it feel? Great, because I think uh, uh, traditionally this community, Lafitte, uh, has access to the water. And so I think bringing the traditional values back uh, bring the community back together. That's an awesome, awesome time to do. All righty. Thank you. all We're going to be back. We're going to talk more about the history of Pete Rogue races at about another hour or so. But for now, I'm going to just check out the men on the water and try to stay cool. But we're going to send it back to you all in studio. That all looks right. like a lot of fun. Duke, can you ask Mayor, uh, Mayor Kerner if he's going to hop in one of those P-Rogues and, and show you how it's done? <laughs> sure. Mayor Kerner, are you actually going to get in one of the P-Rogues and show us exactly how that's going to be done? No, uh, <laughs> I don't think he said so. that fast. Um, I've, I've, I've uh, paddled in the celebrity race already, and, and it, it was all right. But uh, you know, those those people here today, uh -huh. you know, just getting in those things, you need to know what you're doing. Gotcha. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. <laughs> Appreciate it, Eric Sheba. Uh -huh.